That's your typical September weather. Here's Joe. All right, we're hotter than normal, and then we're going to get cooler than normal. We've been drier than normal, and the opportunity for much needed moisture is going on the increase. So near record heat for the weekend in the Albuquerque area, limited showers and thunderstorms throughout many areas of the state. It'll be more active in eastern parts of New Mexico, and then wet and cooler conditions ahead. So we need the moisture, we need the cool down, and it is in the offing, not necessarily for the first state fair weekend. We'll still have the near record heat for Saturday, Sunday, and then we get into Monday, temperatures start to drop. Canyon winds start to increase and some isolated showers and thunderstorms, but that will be increasing as we'll be showing you. Here's an area of high pressure. There's the heat around it. Now, as this high pressure system starts to back away, there'll be a disturbance that wraps on the front end of it and really picks up from the Central Mountain chain eastward and then going on into the following day, which would be Sunday, Saturday, I should say. Uh, well, it should be Sunday, basically. Uh, we'll see showers and thunderstorms still flowing throughout eastern parts of New Mexico. Now, here's what we're looking at for the official State Fair forecast. Uh, first of all, it starts uh, will open around 10 o'clock in the morning, so that'd be 79 degrees, and then we get back to above normal temperatures in the afternoon, where you're closer to record rather than normal levels. Statewide for your Saturday, you'll see 60s and 70s around 8 o'clock in the morning. We get to the noon hour, temperatures start to increase, where these are or normal highs, and we're talking about the noon hour for many of us, and then you'll see that cluster of showers and thunderstorms working into eastern parts of the state. And as we get over here the eastern part of New Mexico. Some could have large hail, potentially damaging winds. So this area would be a threat for some severe weather, and then that threat will lower a little bit as we go into the following day for Sunday. So uh, Sunday looks like this. Showers and thunderstorms still rolling off the central mountain chain, kind of limited everywhere else. It will be hot. And here's the big cool down. Uh, big moist air of... Uh, Moist, humid air will start to work down eastern parts of the state. Look at the highs in the 60s and 70s that will push into central parts of the state. So we'll see lower temperatures, increasing showers and thunderstorms across the area. And then it will continue to wrap up as we get into Tuesday and Wednesday throughout many areas of the state for central and western parts of New Mexico. So 80s and 90s in the Four Corners region. And then look at the lower daytime highs and those isolated scattered showers and thunderstorms increasing from the start of the work week and advancing on a Tuesday, Wednesday and Thursday. 95 in Socorro, near 100 in with their consequences. There will be partly cloudy skies, hot conditions through the weekend in Silver City, but showers and thunderstorms a bit more active by Tuesday and Wednesday. Southeast, we'll see 96 over in Alamogordo, 84 Ruido. So here's that cluster of showers and thunderstorms that could be strong to severe across some areas of the east, a little less active on Sunday. And then look at the big temperature drop with increasing storm chances going into the early parts to the middle part of the upcoming week. We'll be in the 80s from Raton, Las Vegas, on into Cedar Crest and then temperatures start to increase as, as decrease I should say as the moisture starts to increase and look at that 66 on Tuesday with some showers and occasional thunderstorms across the area 81 in Chama 90 Española hot through the weekend in Santa Fe with some isolated showers and thunderstorms around and then showers and thunderstorms increase 68 degrees by Tuesday the metro area a mild start but still hot in the afternoon with uh, a near record temperatures throughout Saturday and Sunday room for a passing shower storm Breezy and cooler with some isolated storms around for Monday and then some showers and occasional thunderstorms as we work into the area on Tuesday and then less active as we push out toward Thursday and Friday. So hot for the first weekend of the State Fair and then it does start to drop with increasing much needed moisture, Darlene.